How's it going everyone? Today we are up here at Lake George. Just got the boat in the water. Sun's just rising. We are about to go target some pre-spawn smallmouth bass. The water temperature is right about 50, so they should just be right before spawn right now. Gonna take the boat on plane. First time of the season, so stay tuned. I hope you guys enjoy this one. Uh, 18. It's quite a dock. Got one. Large mouth. What? Large mouth, I got him. You met him? Oh, he got off. He got it on. First cast, right? Look, look at how much he inhaled that. I'm using the rattle and Ned fish. Absolutely inhaled it. You can hear it rattling when he, look at that. Look how deep that is down there. Nice little small mouth. So nice little small mouth. There he goes. Another little. Rock bass. I know, I told you you could have another one. My dad's been uh, struggling a little bit. First time out. Couple snags. So. Nice little rock bass. You can see him. Really nice looking. Pretty colors. Right back down he goes. Now it's 40 feet. Oh, 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 fish right there. I, I saw one chasing it. Can you slow down a little bit? There's a lot of fish below it. I don't know if mine's the best for like vertical jigging though. Oh, that one? oh yeah. Get the net. <laughs> oh, look at that bass. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Nice. Hello, largemouth fell for the Ned. Oh my God, look, look at that thing's belly. Look at that right there. That thing is so ready to spawn. Beautiful largemouth bass, actually in really deep water. The fish is super cold. So we're gonna go ahead and release. There she goes. I've also done a new thing this year with my tackle for organization. We had these old bags laying around and I have a bunch of Plano 3700s. Here's a 36 bar, so I keep have a canoe and stuff, but I've been putting them in there and then all of my uh, soft plastics are just in one of these like open compartment 3700s. So that works out pretty good. Got batteries and stuff. And then I got a bunch of hooks and stuff. This is still a work in progress. I just started doing this stuff. Got a bunch of hooks and stuff in there. Fish right below us. It's fish right below us. The 
The fish or like um the jig? What? Yeah, I think that's good. I think they're actually down deep right now. I mean, that's a largemouth bass. That was in like 28 feet of water. So like, where are the small mouths? Thirty-seven. Yep. Get the net again. Another large mouth. Oh! Just popped off right here at the boat. Because, but he switches with his dad sometimes. Oh, I said a hit. I said a hit. I'll, I'll text him and ask him. Ooh, got him. Get the net. Yes. Another nice. Uh, this is a small map bat. I'm just gonna go ahead and plop this guy back in the water. There he goes, right back down. You can see it, I know. Think? Um, yeah, probably. So it's like really aggressive. Yeah. Another beautiful little smallmouth bath. All right, go ahead and give him a dunk. Bye. Going over to our next spot now. We're gonna try another, uh, back there we were kind of just fishing along a break where it was like 30 feet of water. So we're gonna try to do something like that again and see if we can reproduce what we did back there at the next spot. So we're doing pretty good so far today. Hopefully we get some more. God, is that, is that a lake trout? What's oh, a pike, pike. Oh, it's a pickerel, a big pickerel, holy crap. Yeah, my camera on. Massive chain pickerel. Here, bring it over to me. Oh, holy smokes. <laughs> you should measure that. That's like, I've never seen a pickerel that big. My dad just caught that pickerel. <laughs> 45 and a quarter inch. I've never oh, wow. seen a pickerel that big. Look at that thing. I'm gonna let it go. Yep. Oh. Whoa. Let me go. <laughs> Still going back in. He's swimming back down. That was slimy. He's just kind of hanging in the shade underneath the boat. I think we'll go back down in a sec. Just caught a pretty big pickerel. Uh, a little sandy over here. We're gonna move up further north near Dome Island right now. Beautiful day, gorgeous. Great day to be on lake, even if you're not catching fish, it's wonderful. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my dad just hooked up. I'll come get the net for you. Will it feel big? Oh, yeah, I saw him, holy smokes. We just saw a huge smallmouth bass right back there. My dad's gonna get back down and get him again. Yeah, oh my God, immediately. Oh. No, it's okay. Look at that fish. Look at it. Fish. 
Is that the same fish? I might have to hold some at him. Oh, come here, come here, fish. Oh, okay. Oh. I only have six pound test on for my leader, so I can't uh, just swing a lot of fish in like you see a lot of bass guys doing. I don't want to break my leader. Why do I have six pound test? Because the water here is super clear and you wouldn't catch nearly as many fish if you didn't do that. So that's why we do that. Nice small mouth. Don't right back down. Digging, the bass is digging. What kind of bass is it? I think it's a largey, a small mouth. Small mouth. Nice. Just caught a nice little small mouth. You can see, again, the belly, definitely pretty spawn. Some nice blonde colors. Beautiful small mouth. There she goes. There's a fish right here, Dad. That's a huge largemouth right here. Holy crap. There's like a, there's a brush pile there and he's just swimming in it. It's like right here. It was big, it was thick. So where are you getting up? Is it a little bit closer? I think it's like up there. Got him? Got something. Small mouth. Oh, that's a nice one. Want to scum? No, let's scum on this one. Oh, I should need the net. Got the net? Yeah. I just want to like break my leader, basically. We're trying to go over this large mouth I just saw. Let's see if I can get this guy in the net. That's a pretty good one. Nice small mouth. Not bad. I got, I got, I got him hanging out. Oh, oh, I got one. Yeah. I thought I was just, I thought I got snagged for a sec. I was like, no. Oh, I see the brush pile. I see the brush pile. Just left. Another small mouth. Nice. Bye. We got waves behind us as a fly. Got one. Oh. Small mouth. All right, that's gonna be a wrap for us today. We caught quite a few fish today. My dad caught that really big pickerel. He's catching some uh, small mouse and rock bass right now getting some redemption in for the end of the day. I caught quite a few, uh, some small mouse, some large mouse, and some rock bass. I actually used the same jig the entire day. Oh, look, my dad, like I said, he's catching them. Let's see what he's got. Oh, he's a big one. Oh, he's coming in. This is the best. It's so fun to just sit on the back deck there, catch some fish, have a good time. Let's see. Oh, that's actually a pretty good size one. Nice little small mouth. Want to show the camera? <laughs> right. He's a big one. Nice. So anyway, like I was saying, we're going to head out now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to browse my channel and subscribe. I really appreciate it. We are so close to 2,500 subscribers and it has been a long journey to get here. So I appreciate everyone that supports the channel. Click the little bell for notifications and you can see every time I upload. I had a little bit of a delay between my last videos because I was doing all winter stuff like snowmobiling, uh, ice fishing, all that kind of stuff. So now the summer content is gonna be coming full swing and we actually just got a huge new net for salmon fishing. If you guys watched my videos last year from salmon fishing, 
you will know that we missed a couple fish from our net size. We have, we're not making that mistake again this year, so be prepared. Some salmon content will be coming this year. Anyway, I appreciate the view. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.